Are you still staring at this boring arrow every day? Don't you think it's time for a change? Guess what? It doesn't have to be this way. I'm Tech Enthusiast and today I'm about to show you how you can install a custom cursor on your Windows PC and where to find them. With that said, make sure that you watch until the end for my top 10 free picks, like this video and click on the subscribe button for more tutorials like this one. And if you want to check out the exact wallpaper on my desktop, then click the first link below. Before we begin where to actually find the custom cursor, I should quickly mention that Windows 11 or Windows 10 already has built-in custom cursors. So where to find them? You will navigate here to the start and search for the mouse. Click here on the mouse settings and just click on the additional mouse settings here. Then if you go here to the pointers, you will find plenty of the custom cursors inside Windows. Here, for example, you have Windows Black, you have here Windows Inverted, you have here Windows Standard and the Windows Windows default. So these are already built in custom cursors, but keep in mind that they are nowhere near the custom cursors route in terms of design. So let me right now show you where to actually find a custom cursor. So I usually find a custom cursor on this website, deviantart.com slash tag slash cursors. So this is where you find plenty of the cursors. Here you will find free cursors as well as paid ones as well. But but if you search, for example, for the macOS cursor for Windows, you will also find some of them on the GitHub as well. Just like this one, macOS cursor for Windows. These are two of the websites where you will find plenty of the cursors. For example, if you would like to have the latest cursors for your Windows, you can go here to the right and under the relevance you will change this to the most recent and here right now you will see plenty of the most recent cursors for windows for example here you will find free cursors as well as paid ones just like this one right here you can click on the cursor fluent cursor here and you will see that you will have to pay around four dollars to get this exact cursors but on deviantart.com there are a lot of free cursors as well and right now let me show you how to actually install one of them. If I go here, I will go with the most recent and I will go with this one right here. Now keep in mind that for DeviantArt you will have to have account for this website to be able to download stuff from this website so make sure that you create one it's completely free and it's very easy to do so as well. And once here on this page you will find this arrow and if you click on it you will get this file in zip format. You can click on this folder icon to go to your downloads folder and make sure that you select this exact folder and click on the extract all. Once inside extracted folder here you will have two of the versions of the cursors here you have dark and the light version I will go with the dark one and here you have all the cursors now inside this folder you will find this install file and to install this cursor you will just simply right click on here click on the install and click on open here and this should install a brand new cursor. But if you get this installation failed message here on your computer, there is also another way how you can also install this exact same cursor even if you got that error as well. So make sure that you navigate here to the settings or to the start menu, search for the mouse, click here on the mouse settings and then here you will click on additional mouse settings and you will be redirected to the mouse properties. Now, once here, you will click here on the pointers. And once here, you will basically replaced this normal select cursor and the others as well listed right here with the custom cursors which we got from deviantart.com. So how to actually change this default cursor? It's quite simple. Just select the cursor which you want to select. I will just select here the first one, click on the browse and here you will basically need to find your cursor. You can go here to the this PC you can click here on local disk C, then under the users folder, you'll click on your user. And once here, you will go to the downloads folder, click on the cursor which you downloaded from the DeviantArt and the version which you would like to install. Here, I will go with the dark version. And right now what you will do, you will just simply select the first cursor. In this case is the arrow one. And here you will replace the normal select, which is this default look with this one right here. 
here and I'll just click on open. Now you will just repeat this exact process for every single cursor variation listed right here on this list. So click on the browse and right now just search for the help here. So if you go here under the help, click on open and now just repeat the process for every single here option listed right here. And now once you have every single cursor here changed, you can just click here on save as and you can name it whatever. I will just call it custom cursor and click on OK here and then make sure that you click on the apply. And right now you can select your custom cursor from this list right here. Click on apply and then you can just click on OK. And this is how our current custom cursor actually looks like. Now if you would like to remove the custom installed cursor, you will just select the custom cursor from this list. And here just simply click on delete and Windows should completely remove this custom installed cursor. And right now let's move to my top 10 free picks for custom cursors. And with that said, this is pretty much it for this video. I hope I helped you to install a custom cursor. And if I did, make sure that you smash up the like button and subscribe to the channel would also be much appreciated. And by the way, if you want to know how I got this dock look for my Windows 11 taskbar, then make sure that you check out this video, which should appear right now on the screen. I should also quickly mention that I will leave every single website for the custom cursor as well as every single cursor mentioned in this video linked in the video description below. And with that said, have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you all in the next one.